What do I think about Clomid versus Inclomiphene? Well, Inclomiphene is probably less bad, but they're both bad options in my mind compared to something like Pregnol or HCG. I suppose there's a fringe case of someone who's using it for fertility or to um, jumpstart, get the pituitary up and running again uh, on a very short-term basis. Um, or you know, people can use it for fertility if they absolutely cannot or will not use uh, injectables, which HCG Pregnol is an injectable medication. Um, but we really don't know what tissues and where they affect estrogen receptors. Uh, we know that they're an agonist in some tissues like the liver, so they act like estrogen, and they're an antagonist in other tissues like the eye, uh, which is where they're going to tend to cause the visual side effects, uh, floaters and so forth that people can see. Um, they're just not all that effective. They tend to raise total testosterone disproportionately, not as much free testosterone. And uh, I think there's one study out there that showed that on average, the participants had a, a worsening of, of mood or symptoms after starting compared to before. And there are some studies that show positive outcomes, but I don't feel great about it as a long-term medication.